Hi y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Mariah and I hope you're all having a great day. Today I wanted to do a quick unboxing of a new release for you guys from Diamond Art Club. I ordered this on December 19th and just received it in the mail. Today is Tuesday, I think it's the 28th of December. You already know I'm lost with days. On this order I did order uh, one last pen as well. So real quick, let's just take a look at the pen. Hope everybody's doing well, getting ready for the new year. All right, it does come in this pink pouch, they all do, with a, either a white or a pink drawstring. And the pen I got this time, ooh, it's pretty. This one is Amber Topaz, I believe. No, I'm sorry. Autumn. It's Autumn Amber Rain. I apologize. So when you look up at it, it's got like a gold and a copper foil on the inside. Sorry, guys. Lots of specks. It's very pretty. Does come with a single tip. On these pens, Diamond Art Club is advising that you cannot change these single tips, but um, as I said before, you can always change the gold brass if you needed to. It does have on this end, which is reversible, so you can put, if for some reason you couldn't change your single tip here, you could just put another one down here. And these do come with multi-placers, and I'll show you in just a second. Just wanted to show you one last time okay and then with their pins they do come with two multi-placers now these are $14.99 on their website and I believe this one is still currently in stock all right so you're gonna get a seven placer the skinny ones and then it also gives you a they give you a four placer So you get the two multi-placers, the pen pouch, and the pen. All right, so let's move on to this canvas. Okay. All right, moving on. This is the canvas. It's a, it's a big one, guys. And as you can tell here on the side with the blue stripe, it is a square. Which one did I get? This one is Willa by Michael Jelena. You guys, I really like Michael Jelena's work. Her and Mandy are my favorite artists. The diamond shape is square. This is gonna be a 70 by 89. This is a big one for me anyways. Um, if you're looking to frame it, you could use this first set of numbers here as a guide, which is 27.6 by 35. It does indicate there's an AB. I've learned how to <laughs> look for that now. All right, so let's get into it. There's two new Michael Jelena's that were just released this past weekend. However, I have not purchased any yet. I think it's one's I forget the name. The one with the tiger. Sam and Lila or something. And then the other one is Madeline, I think, which with the lemons and the... She's a fairy. She's got, like, the plaid pants and stuff. I, I really want to get that one. The other one, I don't know. For some reason, when I looked at the tiger and saw the eyebrow piercing, it reminded me of Tiger King. And that kind of... I don't know. I think that ruined it for me. All right. So hopefully I can get it all in focus because this is big. All right. So this is what it looks like in the inside of the box. I know I show this. I'm not sure why. It is in a plastic pouch. Let's pull it out. There's the stickers and the toolkit. Alright, so real quick, the toolkit. So 
in a plastic resealable bag. It does advise what the contents is. It's got their branding, Diamond Art Club on the top. This kit is telling you that it's a square. And it also advises what the contents are. The only difference between a round and a square kit is these tweezers right here. So if it's round, you do not get the tweezers. Let's just go over what's in the kit. I'm sure most of you know, but sometimes there's new people that do not know. All right, so in a Diamond Art Club kit, you will get this clear boat with a spout. You're going to get the standard blue pin single placer. You'll get a blue squishy right here. And the squishy just goes on the pin like this, maybe. Got to work with it just a little bit. Sometimes it works, sometimes it does not. Okay, all right. I went up a little too high, but you get the idea. That's just for comfort. It does come with a four placer multi-place. So if you want a multi-place, you would just stick that in the tip. And here's your pen. It's good to go. You get bags. I'm not going to count, but there's probably about 15 or so bags in here. And then you get your two sets of heart-shaped wax. And like I said, with squares, you get tweezers. With Without squares, if it's just around, you will get regular tweezers. And this is, oh, they changed them a little bit. These are a thicker tip. They usually have a thinner silver tip that bends fairly easy. These look different. They look a little thicker to me. I'm not sure. All right. So let's put this away real quick. Do you guys have any plans for the New Year's? I usually don't celebrate New Year's anymore. I did when I was younger, but now I feel like I'm older. I don't really <laughs> do the New Year's. All right, so here's the mini sticker. It's got all the information. It's got the artist, Michael Jelena. It's gonna have the size down here again. You could put this on the box. You can put it in a journal. You could just save it. But it's nice to have, you can also put it on your drill, dr on your drills. So it's nice to have this sticker. And then here's the big sticker. There's the image. It's very pretty. Looks like it's gonna have a border on it. I don't really like too much. My personal opinion is I'm, I don't like too much when they have the border, but I'm sure it looks fine once it's actually completed. But she's a fairy. Love her hair and her style. She's got the leopard going on. She's got some little boots. We got some incense burning right here. She's got a little oil or a pen an ink pod because it looks like she here's her feather pen up here where am I her little feather pen that she's holding so I'm assuming this is like a little ink pod right there that she's dipping the ink in and she's just writing it's got the trees and stuff in the background I really like this image all right so we're gonna have 43 colors on this one I'll show you looks like one a B only Wow just one. Hopefully it's a big bag. Uh, the color we're looking for is going to be 141 on symbol one. Let's see. Yeah, I don't see any other. I'm not showing any other ABs. All right, so moving on to the canvas. You know, even if the kits don't come with enough ABs, guys, especially with the rounds, you can always get, you can always purchase more and customize it how you want. All right, so we got one big bag of drills here. I am noticing that they're doing them longer, these bags. They used to be a shorter, more compact bag. 
looks like they're trying to do them thinner and longer now. It's probably better on the canvases. But you could see like the color theme here, just a lot of like earth tones and things like that. There's no bright colors that I can see or anything like that. It's gonna be more neutrals, I think. And then of course, every kit comes with the step-by-step -step instructions. Now let's take a look at the canvas. I'm gonna roll it back real quick, just so it lays better. All right. You don't have to do this, but because I'm trying to show you guys I like to do it that way. Let's see if we can get it to fit on my table. Ooh, she's big. She goes bigger than my table. <laughs> she hangs off both sides. So let's bring her down just a little bit. Mm, look at her. Here's the feather pen that I was talking about right there. She's got some little jewelry on. You can see her wings in the background. Love her mouth and her eyes. Love her little curly hair and her little hat. I just like everything about it. She's got the leopard outfit on. Again, it's going to have, it looks like a 310 border with another color on the inside. The border seems to be the same width all the way. The sides are even. It's a little bit thinner on the top and the bottom but she's big. I don't know if you can see their canvas sparkles. Ooh, did I get it? Am I getting the sparkle? Yes. <laughs> I can never get the sparkle. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I'm, I'm seeing it. Down here in the bottom left-hand corner, it does have the canvas information with the name, which is Willa. It's gonna have the size and the artist with the thumbnail right there. Let's pull back. Diamond Art Club has the glitter in the canvas. It's also in the drill field. It's kind of hard to see, but it's in there. All right. So, getting back to the canvas, right? Here's the ink pod. At first, I wasn't sure what this was, but the more I looked at the picture, I could see. It's got the ink pod here for her dip in her ink. She's got her book, so she's journaling. Moving down. Her big boots right here, little fur boots. And here's the instant burner up here. I'm not quite sure what this is right here. Maybe just like a little rock or something like that. And then you can see there's a thinner 310 border and then this whatever this copper brown color is right here so lots of opportunities to put incense I or not incense I'm sorry guys I was looking at the incense when I said that <laughs> lots of opportunities to add ABs although I like to accent with ABs but Diamond Art Club usually does a really good job at shading and so I try not to take away but I could tell you I would probably put some in the book Probably in the ink pot over here. Maybe down in the incense if it's not already in there. We'll check for that number one here in a little bit. Jewelry is always fun to customize. And maybe some up here. She's going to be pretty. Love her. All right. So... Let's look at the drills, and I'll just flip this over. Okay. Sorry, guys. Okay. Lots of trains to go through. All right, so the first color we have is 938. It's a brown. 
We got two bags of those. Then we're moving to the 310. I know there's going to be a lot, so we'll just count. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight bags of the 310. And these are pretty good sized bags. We got 3371, which is a brown. We got one, two, three bags of those. Moving over to 400. Two bags of those. We got 346. Two bags of those. And here's our AB. Oh man. So this is it. It's a half bag. You can see it goes to the blue line. But this is white. You can see all the rainbow, kind of. These are Aurora Borealis coated uh, drills. So basically they take the regular drill and they put a rainbow coating over them, like an iridescent, and just gives it extra sparkle. So we only got a little bit of that, but that's okay. We can always add more. And then 356. Moving on, we got 300, 3347, 935, which is like a gray, 780, two bags of those, 754, it's like a peach. 9.51, two bags of those. 37.78, two bags of the 37.76. We got 3.01 and we have one, two bags of those. 758. Two bags of those. 937. 3348. 8.23. 38.53. And then 9.77. All right. Here's a train with our tiny amount of drills here. Okay, we got 8.98, which is a brown. 38.23. Four fifteen. It's like a really light gray. Nine thirty-four. Six forty-eight. Four fourteen. Seven sixty-two. Thirty-three three six. It's like a blue. Three six nine. This is like a. I don't know if I've ever seen this color. Looks like a glow in the dark color. You know how things glow in the dark, the color that they are, like the moon and star things? That's what color this is. 647. 312. 3860. 317. And this is pretty too. 986, 
3022 7099 and 798 All right. One more train, guys. Oh no. <laughs> okay. So these are more 310s, so there's 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 Eight. And I think I said there was nine on the other strand. So what's that, 17? Holy moly. I can't remember how many was on the first strand, but there's a lot of 310s. And then two bags of 939s. All right, so let's flip her back over and look for the ABs. All right, so we're going to be looking for number one. And it's a little bag, so we're not, we're not going to have much of it. So starting up at the top. Let's see. So we're going to have a few of the ABs in our eyes. Just a couple. It is outlining her wings, so where you see the white here. On both sides, those are going to be ABs. So the ABs do outline and highlight her wings. Let's see. We're going to have some interweaved in her jewelry here. So on her necklaces, where you see the white dots, those are going to be ABs as well as down here. And in, in the green area, you'll see a few white dots. Those are also ABs. I do see a whole strip of ABs all the way down and up and over right here. So it looks like the, I guess it's going to be the highlighting is coming from this way. But that's all ABs. Over here, we, we got a little bit. We have some over here and then, like I said, up over here. I don't see any in the book or anywhere else, but moving over to the inset burner. We are going to have it all up in the smoke. So where you see the bright white in the smoke, those are going to be ABs. A little bit right here. And then on the top of this right here, where the ashes are. And then right here. So that's going to be it. Not a lot of areas. However, like I said, um, you can always add more. Square ABs are harder to find, but there's places that you can get them at. And they do, you know, they're, some people are really good with them and do a whole lot of customization. Like I said, me personally, I just like to add a little bit here and there. It depends on the canvas. But this is, let's go ahead and give you one, one last look at her. She's really pretty. She's big. I'll give her that. She's big. She hangs over both ends of my tables. That's why I'm sliding her around. <laughs> but she's really pretty. Okay. All right, y'all. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'll leave the link for her down below. If you guys have never ordered from Diamond Art Club, there's a link as well as a link if you have. I am an affiliate, so I'll leave that information down below. Let's see. Thank you all for watching and listening to me. I appreciate all of you. Hello to my new subscribers. I've been getting new subscribers lately, and I see you guys coming through, and I appreciate all of y'all. With that being said, I'm going to go ahead and let y'all go, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. Bye, guys.